Hello everyone, so today I received this brand new Screen Factory's uh, John Carpenter's They Live 4K Ultra HD Steelbook and I'm very excited and actually one thing that it surprised me today is that I still haven't watched this movie uh, even though it's one of the greatest John Carpenter films of all time and uh, I heard a lot of good reviews for a few years already and I still haven't watched it and but now I can't wait to actually watch it especially on 4K Ultra HD uh, and John Carpenter is one of my favorite directors of all time. I watch a bunch of his movies and my favorites are of course Halloween, Halloween 1, I mean Halloween 1, 2, 3 and of course my number one favorite is The Thing and I like uh, The Fog and also Prince of Darkness. Those are my top six uh, movies from John Carpenter and I feel like this is going to be the number one of the, the seventh of my favorite ones for sure and the still book looks absolutely amazing and I saw the image uh, about a month or two ago and I felt like I'm gonna wait and get this still book instead of the regular edition that got released I don't know when maybe a few weeks ago and this still book is absolutely awesome it comes with a bunch of, bunch of uh, special features and you can see the artwork just look at how amazing uh, this looks uh, very very cool love this image that they picked for this and here's the back uh, the steelbook with all the special features and writing if you guys can pause and read uh, Very very cool. Can't wait to open it um, So yeah, and in the top it says uh, for Keltra HD plus blu-ray no digital code usually screen factory movies They don't uh, come with digital code unless unless maybe in the future they might add that which I think it's a good uh, thing if they add especially for people that uh, don't have a 4K player or Blu-ray player, they can always uh, watch it and stuff. Um, and at the top there's some uh, writings about it and I was actually reading about the film. This past uh, few months or year, even though I haven't watched it to see what it's about and stuff and the story seemed really cool. Uh, the special features actually is Adobe Optimus Audio, audio commentary with director John Carpenter, which I can't wait to check that one. The actor Roddy, Roddy Piper, one of the greatest uh, wrestlers and I'm a big wrestling fan and at the moment when I found out that a uh, long, long time ago that Roddy Piper in this movie I got even more excited. Uh, Independence uh, Thoughts, Interview with John Carpenter on Blu-ray, these are all the Blu-ray discs, they're just special features. Uh, so I believe the 4K is just going to be the movie. Um, so I was kind of reading uh, stuff about the movie to see what the movie is about and stuff and I found out that there are aliens that try to uh, take control of the world and they put the uh, people to sleep and uh, so that way that's the easy way for them to take control and which I already liked it a lot it's been a while that I read that and I'm very excited I'm very excited for this film and I'm actually surprised that I haven't watched it yet uh, that's uh, super shocking uh, but yeah let's actually open this uh, still book around the back around it to see how it looks I actually didn't know if I'm going to uh, pick this uh, movie up uh, and stuff and I saw the for the regular edition uh, a few weeks ago and I was going to pick that up which I'm glad I didn't and I waited um, for this uh, yeah one more time you can see the JCAR right there they used to I don't know if it was the screen back they used to use like a glue or something too and it will make a mess on the still which I'm glad they're not doing that so here's the J card one more time you guys can uh, see it all the story and the special features which is pretty nice um, here and here's the steel book I haven't really checked the back so here's the front again you can see I don't know if in the camera you guys can see it it's shiny, it looks very shiny and cool and here's the back which is still pretty nice I like the front more but here's the back uh, very nice looking steel book and and now let's check out the inside, but oh, there's a awesome picture in the inside, which I really love. Um, usually it's rare, like the inside I love, but this one is, even though it's simple, but I really like it. Before I show you guys, here's the steel book completely open, uh, both back and the front, which is pretty nice. I like this a lot. and. Here's the inside, but let me show you all the this first, even though it's uh, kind of a mess, but you guys can see, actually, I'm going to take the disc out, but here's the inside. Look at this awesome image here, they put, which is simple, but pretty cool, actually. Uh, 
And the disc, the front one that you guys can see, that's the 4K one. But I like the disc. Uh, I was gonna ask like, if you guys like the inside or the outside more for the artwork. I like the outside, of course, but this inside is pretty nice. And uh, here's the 4K disc one more time, which is pretty cool. I like this image. Uh, oh, and actually, the Blu ray disc is pretty cool too. So I'm gonna remove it so you guys can see the disc with the Blu ray disc, which is pretty cool. Right there. Uh, I believe the Blu-ray disc it should be, it should be, yeah, the special features and stuff is gonna be in the Blu-ray disc. And here's the steelbook without the disc, so you guys can see the entire image, which I love. Yeah, they did a great job with the steelbook. Uh, I would give it this nine and a half. It's a pretty good. I uh, I'm glad I picked it up. Uh, even though I haven't watched the movie, it's rare that I pick up a movie uh, for the first time like let's say if I pick a movie and I never watched that doesn't happen all the time usually I pick up movies that I already watched unless if it's a brand new movie and I miss them in the theater then that's how I like to get them on the physical media but uh, but this movie I'm pretty sure it's awesome I heard a lot of good reviews I seen some parts of it but I haven't watched the entire movie yet I can't wait to watch it tonight and it's absolutely amazing let me know if you guys watched the film uh, my Top favorite John Carpenter movie of all time is uh, The Thing, and then I'm gonna go with uh, what I will with Halloween Three, uh, and then Prince of Darkness, uh, Halloween One, Two, and then The Fog probably. But I love all of them. But my top favorite, I'm, I'm gonna say, is the, the Thing, and I love that film a lot. So now I can't wait to check this um, with the story that I read. Actually, I have the paper uh, right over here that I was writing about at some parts and it says Horror Master John Carpenter, uh, Halloween The Thing direct this hard pounding thriller uh, in which aliens are systematically gaining control of the earth by uh, masquerading as humans and uh, lulling the public into the submission uh, humanity's last chance lies with the lone drifter who stumbles upon a harrowing discovery a unique pair of sunglasses that reveals the terrifying and deadly truth. So that sounds pretty awesome and with uh, all these special features, but I'm definitely first gonna check the movie and then I'm gonna check uh, check the special features. And I'm actually curious what you guys think about this film. Do you guys liked it? If you guys watched, do you guys pre-order this? Did you guys uh, got the movie already? Let me know what you guys think about the movie and the still book. I'm gonna give this a nine and a half out of 10. It's pretty awesome. Uh, looking still book the back front and the inside and also i'm going to post some pictures and give my opinion on my instagram so if you guys haven't followed me on instagram the link is in the description down below i post uh pictures and stuff about my collectibles as well and also feel free to like and subscribe for more unboxing and review videos and until next time i'll see you guys later